Alrighty, guys. <clears throat> Delay taken care of. It was lunch, by the way. Just so you know. Let me see if I can handle this now. How strong were you? Mm. Potentially handle this. Probably not. But, you never know. I did just bless my stuff. And I have, uh... Plus 20 radiance. And I'm harder to hit. Why did our combat turn end? You need to go. Those two are not an issue. an actual ghost, the spirit of a dead wizard or shaper imprisoned by the powerful force that controls this place. The force acted as a guardian. As it fades away, liberated by your final blow, you feel a sense of relief and gratitude. You released it from its imprisonment. And it dropped things. Get out of here. A rune onyx, which... magical essence, and another... Speed enhancement. The shades have gathered up all the books and scraps of paper they could find in the mines and brought them here. Since then, most of them have been shredded. One section of the book, however, remains intact. This book of crafting of items using the enchanted anvil is highly unfortunate that more didn't survive. The entry remains quite intriguing. Once you have a number of pairs of boots formed by the shaping of arts and perfected them, they can be imbued with a wide selection of powerful enchantments. For example, they can become a grounding device, focusing the talents of a shaper and leading to more effective creations. Hmm. The trim of skin of Erdrakon. Deep focus orb. Of course, I don't have one of those. Torn to pieces, no longer of use. Torn to pieces, no longer of use. So, what's back here? Something even worse? Soul Taken Sister? Lovely. It's very rude. Oh, I have to wound them.
Yes, yes, I'm stunned repeatedly. I know. Neat. Lightning bolt damage. Warg! Oh, wait, I did. Okay. Instant mind control. Rat. I do not approve. Intelligence crystal, you're supposed to be more resistant to this thing. These things. Taking multiple turns, you brats. The real seal. Nice. More undead bane. Was there something in there? I actually looked at the sapphire ring. And not at what was in the item's inventory. Now what? Thousand five hundred health. I don't think I'm strong enough to beat you up. Wow. 
I only had an 18% chance to parry. Cracks have peered all over its surface. The creature shakes itself. The outer layers of its stone skin peel away, falling to the ground, shattering. There is a smooth stone surface underneath it, covered in delicate carved runes. The runes begin to glow softly. The golem now has some sort of magical protection. Because I hate it. Oh, great. Damage counter. Blade warded. Sorry, Golem, you do not get to do that to Crystal. Sure, he gets three hits. What a bum. Haste wore off. Have a 
have a lightning aura. You chill out, Crystal. Golem shudders again, its skin peels away. This time, however, there isn't another layer underneath it. Instead, you see the inner workings of the golem. You see what looks like a shifting agglomeration of gravel held together by fine crimson traceries of magic. The creature starts to fall apart. As it does, however, its movements speed up and its blows become more powerful, spending its last moments of its existence in a devastating frenzy. Ow. I can't say that I'm a fan of this piece of crap golem. Because, quite frankly, I'm not. I hate his guts, and I want him to die. Yes, you are teleported now. And stop taking three turns because it pisses me off. I've already lost my haste. Unless they tried to slow me. How do you miss that quickly, Crystal? I'm just curious. You got 70% chance to hit and you missed twice in a row. And it's now your blade wood. barrier. Probably not very good, considering my very minuscule amount of mental magic. Wow. Z 
zero percent chance to hit. got feared. I really dislike you. Like, seriously. Out and out hate would be a good description. If you would cease existing, this would please me. I need more blessing magic is what I need. <clears throat> My poor throat. Just ignore. Just zoom in on me. attack each turn that uh, curses and weakens because I hate my life. <laughs> 